of priority. Black box you recovered from the crashed helicopter was severely damaged and cannot be used. Go to the second crash site near beloved village and retrieve another black box. Eliminate two mimics in the village near the crash site. Gotta go due north. We're in our click. Ahead, I could see the depot. We had earlier found a note from another stalker that said that they'd hidden a weapon on one of the shelves. It would make sense to head over that way as we move further up. Everything was starting to become a little bit normal now, but one thing you never get used to is that sun. Just as a strange new anomaly type effect here in the forest. It looks like black strings coming off the trees. Extremely painful to walk through and it does attract the walkers. Maybe I should investigate this later. Put this in the diary. gas canister would come in handy but if I use it it's going to kill them but it is going to attract more walkers in the area maybe we could take them all out at once
Jesus. Get the shit out of me. Let's see if we can get some of these anomaly balls. And maybe we really should leave before it gets too late. I don't want to be further out into the unknown part of the radius in the dark. we find it, we need to get out of here. Such a long way to go, not even halfway. And already the beautiful radiated sun has set. While it may look beautiful, it does make it extremely dangerous to move through the forest here. NPSC, Explorer 12, Log 8-14, Mimix. Mimix appeared to be a silhouette replica of a military soldier, even appearing to be equipped with firearms. They are entirely composed of black material and have been observed firing on UMPSC explorers in the field. Directly after the Pechorsk event, both USSR and NATO sent armed forces into the radius to investigate and confront possible threats. Very few of the soldiers returned, and those that did died horribly soon after. Explorers never found any bodies belonging to military personnel in the radius. Over time, some explorers have become more and more convinced that mimics are the lost soldiers from the first days after the event. 
However, there is nothing about bodies of mimics apart from their shape that suggests they were ever human. The UMPSC believes, and I concur, that whatever mechanisms are in place here that produce radius-specific species took the soldiers as a template, but the connection ends there. So if I've got this right, the anomaly event used military soldiers as a template to create new entities out in the radius. So they look like soldiers and are armed with real weapons. I need to get some light. Let's put that damn torch. This might attract the enemy, but I'd rather be able to see where I'm going through the anomaly field. Ah! 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 Ah!